an ICO token can be considered the investor's initial contribution. The logic is simple, the more money the investor hands over, the more tokens he will obtain. Quite a few compare the tokens with shares, however, that's not how it is, because these don't make the investor an owner of part of the business, like happens in the stock market. With said tokens, the investor could buy future services from the business and he also have the possibility of selling these tokens. Convincing the investors to put their money in a token, in an IGO, isn't simple since the business that carries out the operation has to make certain promises like, for example, percentages of future income or another value or a service that is offered on the platform. Controlling that the agreement made in the ICO between the business launching the cryptocurrency and the token holder are being complied with is done through a smart contract. This type of agreement is a software, programmed so that if an agreed-upon action takes place, the answer is automatically executed.